So Jeff, you got an awesome Instagram page. It's very high quality. You ready yeah. to take a look I'm at ready, some of the top performing posts? Yeah. First one, you put it together really well, huh? Yeah, I was taking out the combine, just throwing it out there. Pretty good. That's a nice suit. You got the blue going, no tie. Yeah. Is that the usual look when you dress up? Yeah, I think so. No tie, keep it casual, but look sharp. So what else can we expect from you in the, in the suit world? Try to be a little flashy. Yeah, my, my draft suit was really nice, I think. I liked it a lot, I mean. But I like to keep it classy, too, so a little flashy, but keep it classy. And speaking of draft night, yeah. here you are with the devil sweater on, Marty Brodeur in the background. That looks amazing on you. That was an awesome moment. I, was, I think I pointed at my family right after that pick was taken, so that was awesome to put the jersey on for the first time. And what do you think about those colors? I think I look good in red. I like it, man. <laughs> red and black's pretty dirty. The next photo, here you are, Manhattan Beach Pier with a couple of your buddies. Yeah, me at the beach with a couple of my buddies. I think that's Manhattan Pier with the barstool shirt on too, so that was, a, uh, that was a fun trip. Big time beach guy or what? I like the beach, I mean, never really grew up around one, but uh, I, lo I love going to LA. Uh, so what you think about this one? Yeah. And this have beach? you seen the Jersey Shore yet? No, I haven't seen the Jersey Shore, but I want to learn to surf one day. There's definitely waves, really? so I think surfing may be in your future, so you got that going. Next one, New Hampshire. That's just me and my family on my lake house. I think we we're leaving right there, so try to go there for it sounds terrible, but a week to 10 days, I mean, we're so busy, that's where we see all of our family, so it's always fun there. That's cool, so how'd you end up choosing New Hampshire out of all the places? Well, we lived there for a lot of years. We lived there for four or five years. I have a lot of family from New York, from Boston, so it's relatively easy to get to. Cool, all right, so if somebody's visiting New Hampshire, what do you suggest them to do? Go on the water, jet ski, wake surf, that's that's pretty much our day, not get off the water. That sounds like the life. Oh, it's the life, man. It's, it's nice. Also, on your spare time, you like to check out some other sporting events. Yeah. And here you are at a basketball game. Yeah, I love basketball. I mean, pretty high on Lonzo Ball at the time. It was his rookie year, so got to go on the court and watch Lonzo play. And we had tickets that were literally, like, not, not courtside, but, like, one row back, so it was pretty cool. We're going to end with this photo. Yeah. Awesome. Team USA, Captain Big C right there. Is this hanging up anywhere in your house? No, it's not. It probably should though in five, ten years maybe. So it's a uh, pretty sweet pick. We see all these Instagram posts. What would you say is your favorite part about the platform? Building your brand is pretty awesome. I mean, obviously you want to be a popular athlete, an athlete that the fans can connect to and see from afar. So I mean, you want to be a uh, kind of attractive guy to be around. You want the fans to like you. So that's. That's kind of what we're doing right now, just trying to build the brand. For the plug, why should everybody at home follow you and what do you have to offer? Good Insta, got my confidence up with a couple more Insta <laughs> followers, so, uh, so why not?